Hey guys. No, I'm not Brittany. I'm not a sub, and I'm not on this channel. Um, I'm just here because I was asked if I wanted to do a video for today, along with Brittany's. You'll still get her video, don't worry. Um, and it's just cool, so I'm doing it. So here's my video. Um, yeah, I'm Liana. Hi, how do you do? Um, this week's topic will be about discrimination. Um, have you, as a queer, uh, faced discrimination of some form, or have you been in a room full of people you're not out to yet, and heard or had some ne negative marks about a gay person? Everyone knows that discrimination is unfair treatment towards um, a group or a person um, on the basis of prejudice. It's been prejudice. Um, so yeah, I everyone, 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 everyone faces some sort of discrimination one time in their lives for anything. And of course, being a queer, I face discrimination. Um, you face it everywhere. You can face it in your school, when you're applying for a job, when you're walking on the street. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> um, you can face it when you try and sleep at a hotel or something, or you can face it, you can face it anywhere, really. You can, anywhere. Um, the first time I ever faced discrimination for my sexuality was um, when I was in school. Like, okay, so say if my head teacher saw a straight couple holding hands or kissing down the corridor, she would just smile at them or just walk on or whatever. But if it was me and my girlfriend and we were holding hands, she would come up to us and tell us that it wasn't appropriate on school grounds and we'd have to stop. And I thought that was really nasty. And that's discrimination. And she gets away with it because she's a head teacher, which isn't so fair, but hey. And so, you know, every time that that, that happens, we would just have to, you know, face it, deal with it, whatever, because you can't stop it. I mean, there's laws against discrimination, but they're not always followed. I mean, not allowed to be, not allowed to be discriminating when someone wants to do a job and just because they're gay or something, you're not allowed to discriminate them from doing the job, to be fair. Yeah. Yep. Uh, so the second thing, I have actually, I have actually been in a room full of people that I wasn't out to, and had to sit there listening to them make negative remarks about queer people. We, it was when I was just sitting in, I was sitting in my living room with um, my family, and they were just talking, and we were watching TV, and these gay people came up on TV. It was just like something, like a film or something, and there's just gay people on there, and um, and they were, like, talking about the gay people, as in, like, you know, nasty and stuff, like, saying, oh, look at them, the fags on TV, that's disgusting, all that crap, and obviously I couldn't say anything because I was secretly gay, and I was hiding in my closet, and I couldn't say anything because I didn't want them to know <laughs> at the time, but I stopped now, obviously, but back then, you know, and it's kind of difficult to deal with <laughs> as well. Um, but yeah. It's the deal with it, right? I mean, there is people you can tell. There is, really. Um, but yeah. Discrimination sucks. Um, can I have that in capitals, please? That's better. Discrimination sucks. Right, um, well, that's it. I hope you enjoyed my video, and thank you for letting me make a video on your channel. It was real cool. And yeah, 